every good room needs a little greenery. So I came up with this really cool project that we're gonna convert a clock into a hanging wall planter. Well, I'm a little afraid I have no greenery because I can't keep this stuff alive, so. <laughs> Well, I knew you'd say that, so that's why we're using succulents for this project, because they're very easy to take care of. Okay. And all you need to do is once a week, or every other week, just spray them with a little bit of water, or you can just drop an ice cube in them, and that'll keep them alive. Oh, I like that even better. All right, so to start this project off, we're gonna take a clock, unscrew the back. What's left is I've got the outer rim of the clock and the plexiglass that goes in front. I'm gonna put this straight edge on here, and I'm gonna draw a line through it with this not-so-permanent marker. Okay. And at this point, that just gives us a line to cut on. I'm gonna let you do a little scoring. How's that sound? Okay, sounds good. Try to score it down this line. Okay. Great. Ding! Awesome! Oh. So I'm gonna ask you to run a nice thin bead from like here to there. And then the tighter in the corner, the better. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Is that enough? Let's give okay. it a shot. So we're gonna throw that down off in there. This is a planter, so I don't want the water to come out, you know, when you do water. I get these. it. Now it's time to hot glue the rest of this baby on. Just try to stay as close as you can to the edge. All right. You gotta move fast with that hot glue. It sets oh, pretty quick. Okay, thank you. And then we're just gonna put it in here. Okay, now what I've got to do is just fill it with our sand. Okay. And I like to do a little sand at the bottom because that becomes a reservoir for any additional water that's in there. I never knew that. Well, you learn here today, honey. Okay, so let's first fill up a little bit of the sand. Do you want to put some in there? We can just go all sand. We don't have to go potting soil because succulents are used to living in arid places. That looks great. And I'm gonna take one of my little potted succulents that I've got here, and you wanna pinch the bottom to release any roots. Okay. That's how you get it out of there, so you don't pull it from the top and break the plant itself off. And we're going to place them inside. A little shimmy. There goes a manicure. Tell me about it. <laughs> right? I'm just doing a little alternation. Different plants. Yeah. What's great is they'll start to grow their own root system in here. I never would have came up with this. I can't, <laughs> no? <laughs> I can't even. I love it. Awesome. Okay, well, there it is. What do you think? I love it. You do? Yes. I love it. Oh, great. Okay, so we have one down. We're going to do two more, and then we'll hang them on the wall. All right, let's go. Okay. Okay.